Hey everyone, and we're here at Windows Report, and in this video I will show you how to fix the Windows Update Error Code 0x802400023 in Windows 11. So the first solution that you should always take in consideration is to run the SFC and DISM scans. Now to do this, press the Windows button, then type in CMD and then run command prompt as an administrator. Now in the command prompt window, make sure to type in the following commands and press enter after each command. Note that the scans can take a bit of time, so don't lose any patience. These two scans will try to fix any problems with your PC and then you can close this window, restart your computer and check to see if the problem still persists. Moving on, another useful solution is to run the Windows Update Troubleshooter. Now to do this, press the Windows button, then select the settings icon and afterwards make sure that system is selected on the left pane and then on the right side scroll down until you find the troubleshoot category and click on it. Now in here click on other troubleshooters and the last thing you have to do is click on the run button next to Windows Update. Now Windows will try to scan for any issues and fix them as soon as possible. You can then close these windows, restart your computer and check if the problem still persists. Next in line, another useful solution is to clear the Windows Update Cache. Now to do this, press the Windows button, type in Disk Cleanup and then select it as an application from the search results. The next thing you have to do is select your default drive, in my case it's C, where the Windows OS is installed and then press on the OK button. Now the next thing you have to do is click on the Clean Up System Files option and then again select your default drive and press on OK. Wait for a bit until everything is calculated in terms of what you have to clean up and then in the next window make sure to tick in the boxes next to Windows Update Cleanup and Windows Upgrade Log Files. Further than that you can also select pretty much everything you want in here because it's safe to delete them and then press on OK to start the cleaning process. Note that this can take a bit of time so don't lose any patience, just relax and wait until everything is figured out. You can then check if the problem still persists. Moving on, another useful solution is to restart the Windows Update Surface. Now to do this, press the Windows button, then type in Services and then select it as an application from the search result. And as you can see, the list is quite big, so if you want to find the Windows Update service directly, click on a random service, then type in the first letter of the service you're looking for. In our case, it's W. From here on, just scroll down just a bit more and you'll find the Windows Update service. Double click on it and from here on, make sure that the startup type is set to automatic and then just click on the stop button if the service status is set to running. This will take a bit of time and afterwards, all you have to do is once again, click on the start button. This will restart this service and then you can just press on OK, close the following window, restart your computer and check if the problem still persists. However, as an alternative, we highly recommend you to try out Restoro, which is an app that specializes in scanning and repairing any issues with your Windows operating system faster than you think. At the same time, Restoro also repairs damage caused by malware, which is a great plus in functionality. So make sure to check out the link in the description below. And that's it, super simple, isn't it? Of course, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit the like button and as usual, subscribe to our channel. Thank you.